Okay, I got my stuff that I needed from the fish store. So I'm gonna go ahead and start it up. Ninja 500R or EX500. Face shield down, first gear, here we go. Coming up to the turn signal. Actually, this is a pretty comfortable bike to ride. It's pretty good for first timers too. Um, it's got a lot of power, a lot more than the 250 Ninja. I know a lot of people who start out start out with a 250 because you know just because it's small and it's a lot more lightweight. But this bike actually is pretty uh, pretty manageable. I mean, you know, you could put both feet down and rock it back and forth and it's got good acceleration um, no problem for riding on the freeway I get about maybe 150 miles per tank full and I've got 21,000 miles on it right now and uh, I did a tune-up about a year ago and tightened the chain and put turn front turn signals on and all kinds of stuff and I've had no problems with it. Uh, it runs real good. So we're going to go ahead and post this vlog and see if I get any any hits on it. Okay, first gear, here we go. First gear, second gear, third gear. Fourth gear, and here's where I dev. So, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna go a little farther. Fifth gear. One of the reasons I got the camera was because so many people have turned left in front of you and you know so many potential accidents that if anything does happen I've got it recorded on video so I can use it uh, in court. And here we go. I'll turn in here. Nice truck. 
watch out. So I hope uh, it comes out pretty good. Right now I've got the camera adjusted perfectly level with the helmet when the helmet is sitting on like on a table the camera is level so we're gonna see if it needs to be adjusted in any way there's my truck I just got it painted and let's see what happens Always want to turn your bike off in neutral. And then turn the key off. Kicks down. The I always use the center stand. Not a lot of people use the center stand, but I don't know, for some reason, you know, I know the bike's not going to tip over anything, but I just like to put it on the center stand so that it's nice and level. So, okay, let's see how uh, this motorcycle vlog turns out.